Yeah. So I'm moving to Sydney. Uh, <laughs> that's new. Uh, am I nervous? Yes, obviously. It's a brand new start. I barely know anybody there. But I'm excited. I'm excited for it. Yeah, it's been it's been fun. I'm glad I started the YouTube channel. So I don't think I'd have the confidence to kind of or the drive to really record stuff and put it on the internet at this point if I hadn't started like a year ago. Uh, but yeah, this way people can keep up with uh, me in a whole other content. <laughs> I have to start being responsible now. I somehow spilled water on my shirt, like putting this on somehow. So that's not off to a great start. But yeah, I'm excited. I have absolutely no idea. Shall I just call me a toy? You hide the goddamn place. Okay, now I'm feeling better. So, I'm in Sydney now. Uh, wow. Uh, it's been I've been here for like a week now, and uh, it's it's pretty great. I'm settling in fine. The first couple of days were hectic, definitely. I had to go around, you know, get stuff. But yeah, what the hell am I even doing in Sydney? Is a good question. I am a university student now, like everybody who's 22. Yeah, I'm at Western Sydney University in sydney i am pursuing a bachelor of medical science which is like one of the pathways into medicine because that's kind of what i'm hoping for right now there's also other pathways you can go into like research or well pharmaceuticals or like other areas you can pursue if you want to but for now i think i might go into medicine but stuff can change yeah so it was like i said a very spur of the moment thing it was um I think I applied like in the middle of January for the March intake. If you've applied to university, I think uh, it's like really cutting it close. And I got the offer like, um, I think a week after that. And the deadline for the well, payments and all that was like 31st of uh, January. It's yeah, 31st of January. And I got my offer, unconditional offer, I think 25th of uh, January, which is like really cutting it close, especially because you can't uh, do all these transactions from Sri Lanka. Somehow, 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 uh, I got it done, got it paid. And uh, yeah, then it was just loads of work. The visa process, uh, medicals, biometric appointments, bank statements, and it was a really hectic two, uh, two or three weeks because my uh, course started on the 7th of March and I arrived here on the 3rd of March and to do that, I really, 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 really wanted to, um, yeah, finish up the process as quickly as possible. Yeah, uh, speaking of Australia, I think I should mention uh, Aspirations, my agency. Yeah, I think the real reason I'm like, uh, I got to, uh, like, I got to be here even be before my course began is be really because of them. Well, as I said, I applied in like mid-January, got my offer in like a week and well, they kind of like helped me through the process because I really didn't know what I, what I was doing. They're really pleasant people to work with and uh, well, they get the job done. Like I'm not even kidding. I applied for the visa on the 5th of February, 5th of February. And uh, I got my medical on the 10th of February and my biometrics appointment was on the 11th of February. So after that, I was kind of um, stuck at home waiting for my visa and uh, I received it on the 23rd of February. So in like, I think uh, two and a half weeks, which is, which is really fortunate uh, considering events. But yeah, if you want to check them out, uh, I really, 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 really highly recommend them. Like mine was a really, really, really late applicant. As I said, it was a lot of long nights, which they are not obliged to do. They can do it on their own time at office hours. That's totally fine. 
but uh, yeah they they really get the job done and they're really committed to well uh, being an educational provider so yeah i'm really grateful for them and you can find their links down in the description yeah if you're thinking about it if you're serious about it just go check them out like uh, it's up to you so i am in sydney now which is pretty sick and i want to keep vlogging just to kind of keep my parents on the loop about you know what i'm doing i send them pictures all the time but you know it's fun to it's fun might be fun for them to kind of watch a video about what i'm doing uh but from what the workload seems like it'll just be me sitting in my desk studying all day yeah so let's do some vlogs in sydney definitely subscribe and like this video because you like it you do i'll see you next time yes that works right